Taking a look at your future track on this Friday, we'll see things start out cloudy when you wake up in the morning. The clouds will be with us as we go through the day, eventually turning over to some light showers. Again, favoring some of our southern and southeastern counties later on today. I think the better chance of rain overnight will be east of I-35. That's where some of you could pick up half an inch, maybe close to three quarters of an inch if the rain can hold on a little bit longer. And then the clouds hang around on Saturday too potentially some light showers working in again favoring our eastern counties as we go through the day. They should try to clear out as we head into Sunday though. That'll eventually bring back some warmer air. Until then it's going to remain chilly temperatures starting in the 40s today. They'll climb up into the lower 50s, upper 40s in the afternoon. I think future track going just a little too warm with those temperatures. I think we'll be closer to 49, 50 degrees for your high temperature. And then as we go into Sunday morning, we'll start off in the 40s or Saturday morning rather starting off in the 40s and Saturday during the day getting into the lower 50s across the area. Again, with the cloud cover hanging on, we won't warm up much. We'll start to warm up as we head into Sunday, though. That's when we'll get some more sunshine in here. 42 for your low Saturday. I've got a 30% chance of rain coming up on Saturday during the day, but look at Sunday warming up into the lower 60s and then looking at the rest of your 10-day forecast, mid, mid 60s on Monday, mid 60s on Tuesday. Christmas Day, we're expecting highs in the 70s, and then we'll be watching for the potential for some showers and thunderstorms as we head towards the end of the week. That's a look at your updated 10-day forecast. Thanks for watching First Alert 25. I'm meteorologist Josh Johns.